the influence of Queen Victoria had on literature, technology, and other ways of life during mid to late 1800s is explored in a new Marquette Regional History Center exhibit. Victorianism in the Upper Michigan shows what the UP was like over a century ago. The exhibit highlights artifacts the History Center has in its collection that don't regularly get on display, including crafts made during the Victorian era. Women middle class were staying at home for the first time. They were living in the city, um, living in Marquette, and a lot of items were made. There's a wonderful wood-burned chest that was made by actually a man, but there's a lot of really handcrafted things that are really wonderful, and a crazy quilt that was made with silks and velvets and hand-embroidered um, and lots of little details added. So those are really wonderful items from that time. There was a lot of money in the UP in the late Victorian era. Marquette had an opera house that was called the finest in the north, and even the middle class could afford things that we would now consider expensive. You still wanted to have these nice things to show that, hey, I'm middle class too, I'm not poor, I can afford some nice things. A lot of those things were very affordable, so we think of them as very fancy, and they are to us today. But silver, you could buy plated silver instead of sterling silver and China that wasn't outrageously expensive. So it's much more formal than we're accustomed to, but it was actually very affordable at that time. Victorianism in Upper Michigan opens today and is on display through January 3rd. Members of the History Center can take a special tour of the exhibit and ask Whitler questions September 25th at 6.30 at night.